football season just days away from kicking off. If there's one thing you can count on, it's the dominance out of Hutch from Drew Dallas's squad. TJ Cleland tells us how the Dragons lose almost all of their production, but still might have found a way to get better. Standards, a word used all across junior college football. Let's go! But what it means at Hutchinson Community College is levels above the rest. Yeah, I mean, the goal is not going to change, and that's every year. If it's not perfect, we're going to restart. If the energy's not good, we're going to restart. And it's just a higher expectation all around. The proof is in the results. We're going to dive right in Hutchinson, playing for a national championship tomorrow. Uh, we moved 34 guys on to Division One programs and over 45 to, to other four-year programs. After a historic start, making it all the way to the Junior College National Championship last fall just to fall short, this season comes an even hungrier Blue Dragon squad. To be perfect, you go all the way there and it's just for nothing, you know. We're, we definitely have a chip on our shoulder and it, it means a little something extra this year. Honestly, we just feel like we have to win it this year. You know, we came up short because of ourselves. Like. One, go. Coming into 2023, Hutch returns in nearly zero starters from their title run the year prior. But with head coach Drew Dallas's first reload at the helm of the program, it doesn't seem to be much of an issue. They still find a large target on their backs, picked to win the Jayhawk Conference yet again. You know, everybody else thinks about you a certain type of way, but at the end of the day, it really doesn't matter. And it's, it's fine to know you know, you're going to get somebody's best shot each and every weekend, and, and they know that. you got to get up every, every weekend for a football game because you know your opponent is going to be swinging heavy and, and ready to get you if not. In Hutchinson, T.J. Cleland, 12 News.